Hey everybody, thank you for clicking on the video and today you're joining me from Dorset in Weymouth and we're going to have a little walk all the way along the coast from this side all the way out to the other side grab an ice cream, come back grab some fish and chips and then we're going to have a little cheeky wild camp up on this cliff So we've uh, just made it halfway down the beach. We just stopped off now. Next to some rocks sheltering from the wind. And we're just gonna grab a quick drink. And then get some ice cream. And then walk on further down for some ice cream. It's been a real nice walk. Plenty of dogs out. Weather's just perfect. It's warm enough to just stroll around in a t-shirt, but still cool enough not to get hot while you're walking it's been absolutely perfect I don't think Weymouth could be any kinder to us so we're just gonna sit here grab a drink and move on further down the beach and grab ourselves an ice cream Join our journey. So we walked the entire Weymouth Bay and we've gone all the way along the Pleasure Pier, they call it the Pleasure Pier and as you can see just up there is Noth Fort and I would love to buzz my drone over there but I think I'd lose signal. I would love to get it over there though. But if you have a look behind me, you can see um, over there where we set off from and we've gone all the way along and all the way around 
and we've made it all the way to the pleasure pier and now we're gonna have to walk all the way back around so we're gonna go and grab an ice cream we're gonna go and relax for 10 minutes and we're gonna make our way back around and then we'll have a little chill out on Bowley's Cove maybe get some fish and chips for supper and then we'll set up camp for the night go and find somewhere nice for a little wild camp so follow us back round and uh, we'll see where we can find a pitch Hey guys, so we're just about to slope off down the hill now, go and get some fish and chips. Uh, I'm going to have a large fish and chips, Josh is going to have a kids fish and chips, maybe some mushy peas. And we're going to sit up here on this bench, just take in the scenery and get our food into us. So I'll catch you in a minute once we've been down the chippy. <laughs> you looking forward to your chips Josh? Good lad. Right guys, now we are definitely at the seaside, fish and chips are in cannot wait to get this down me absolutely starving we've done about 20,000 steps today across the coastal path all the way across Weymouth Bay so we're gonna spend half an hour now sitting looking at the sea eating our fish and chips and then we'll think about nipping back to the car for our big pack and going having a look where we're gonna pitch up for the evening catch you guys in a few minutes okay guys so we're heading back out into the wilderness back onto the rural coastal path and as you can see fully loaded pack Whew, not easy after some fish and chips <laughs> right so we've got a bit of hill to get up over a few fields and then we'll see if we can't find somewhere to relax and get ready to pitch up as soon as that sun starts setting hey guys so here we are just found a little pitch Looks like somebody's beat us to it though, because unfortunately somebody's had a fire and scorched the grass, but that's not a big deal. We're going to hunker down in this corner here once all of these people start to vanish. There's, there's a fire there, was there? So yeah, once all these people over here start to vanish and we start losing the light, I'm going to pitch up. I'm in the Lanchan 2 today, so I'm going to get the Lanchan 2 pitched up and we'll, we'll try that out for the night. It's a little bit cold for that to be honest, but we should be alright. We've got plenty of gear to keep us warm. So me and Josh are going to set that tent up, see how long it takes us. <laughs> it, may, it may be that it takes longer because I haven't actually pitched the Lanchan before, so I'll allow an extra 10-15 minutes just to be sure. And my little Eru can give me an hand. You can help me out, Josh? Yeah. He's going to help me out as well. So, I'll bring you back once we set the tent up, guys. We're just going to go and have a look over the cliffs and see what we can see. We're just going to ditch our bags. Yeah. Leave them here. And we're, we're going to have a look over the edge of the cliffs just there. Okay, guys, we're losing light. I've managed to get the lunch on up. I did pitch it slightly early because I've never pitched it before and I just wanted to check it out and I didn't want it to be an absolute catastrophe but it's not looking too bad I just got to put everything in there and set up now but as you can see it's reasonably tight I'll go around and tweak it later big vestibule Flames Creed Lanchan 2 with the J door so I'm going to have a bag in this side bag in the other side me and Josh inside so I'm just going to 
quickly walk you around the tent needs a little tweak up there on the back as you can see but it's up that's the main thing everything's up, everything's up. that's the main thing it's pretty tight this side so I just need to mirror this side on the other side and tweak it up a little but overall not too bad so I'm just gonna get all the, the rest of the stuff packed into it and then we can uh, go and have a hot chocolate or something catch you guys in a few minutes right guys so it's all about hot chocolate brew with a the view there's the view and there's the brew so I've got a couple of uh, takeaway cups that I've got organized a couple of sachets of hot chocolate and just boiling off some water so we're gonna have a nice hot chocolate and then hunker down in the tent which is down there so you can just about see it peeping out in the corner we have lost the light sunset is just about to set it is a pretty sight. it's very pretty so we're just going to grab this hot chocolate with the last bit of light and then jog on down to our tent and hunker down for the evening right guys as you can see we're now in the tent we're hunkered down for the evening we are just about to lose the rest of the light so we've got a hot chocolate in our bed and we're going to watch a couple of YouTube videos and uh, hopefully it's not too cold overnight. Do you think you'll be warm enough? Mm. I think we'll be warm enough. Right guys. See you in the next clip. See you in the morning guys. Bye bye. Good morning guys. As always, we're up early and we're leaving. The sun's just rising over there. So that means our tent has to go. So as you can see, we've left no trace, just a bit of flat grass. I can just about start hearing the dog walkers coming, so we're out of here. Massive thank you for watching the video. Really appreciate it. Click like and subscribe. Me and Josh really appreciate it. And Josh, say goodbye. Bye. Are you warm enough? Good lad. Right, let's go then. Catch you later, everyone. Thank you for watching.